Oh god, right into the base. Oh god, right at night time. Oh god. Get out! No! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> uh -oh. <laughs> yeah, it's gonna all just explode. Need to turn off the liquid O2 pump, by the way. Oh, shit, yeah. yeah fucking right. Completely forgot about that. Um, is this now filled? No, it's 900 kilos. Fine. We're going to launch this rocket again straight away. So, let's get the old gantry out. Get her done. Forgotten about the, uh, the pump. I stopped looking at that liquid oxygen. I should have been looking at it. Has it exploded? Come on, game. Has it exploded? Oh, fucking overlay lag now. Come on. Oh, Jesus. Oh, darn. Uh, well, that could have been worse, I suppose. 200 kilos of super, super chilly, chilly air. It's kind of nice. It's the new form of form of air conditioner. Um, does that mean that this one's gone as well? 187. Yeah, this is going to pop. Mm -mm -mm. <laughs> Not anymore. Yeah. Portable air conditioning. Uh, liquid hydrogen. Uh, Pluies, uh, if you go to my YouTube, buddy, I did a video on it a couple of days ago. Uh, or yesterday, I think it was. Have a look at the... Um, there's a recent video with hydrogen cooling. Fuck, how's that happened? I had to make liquid hydrogen. I think this bottle's gonna burst while they're carrying it, by the way. They're like a walking bomb. <laughs> this isn't going to be good. Does temperature change not happen when they're carrying stuff, I wonder? How much are they carrying as well? 200 kilos. Yeah, it's minus 179 here. So that should have that should have become um, that should have already become gas. Like there we go. Interesting. Well, all the rest of it flooded out here. That is really annoying. That is a really dumb bug, but meh. So we're just waiting on our astronaut, and then we'll get this launched. Um, and let's get a few more of these tiles in if we can. Have we got any enough tungsten yet? <laughs> the unsuspecting carrier of a ticking time bomb, yep. Ah, oh, Jesus. So yeah, we uh, we wasted a lot of oxygen there. It's really annoying. And we, we knew this was going to be a bug, but I hoped it wouldn't happen when we started doing it with the uh, piping and liquid oxygen. I think what I need to do before I fill it next time, when the rockets come home, I need to click it, make sure it's reset, and then, uh, only then do I fill it up. I think that's what we need to do, basically. Which is fine. So yeah, another rocket launch, guys. We're going to send him here. Um, and away we go. This is going to be warm. You might want to get out of here. I love that. So now we've got some hot oxygen as well. Lovely. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Okay. <laughs> He's 
These boys are out of food again. Oh, it's because the pinch pepper nuts aren't in yet, so they're not making um, they're not making the better food yet. It kind of blows. I need to do this oxygen setup, don't I? I keep putting it off for derping around with rockets. There's another soup been burnt off, which is incredible. Checking on them and actually be built with um, with gold, and then we'll do you two, and then your bunker tiles there, aren't you? Yeah. Lovely. Your first astronaut is going to be Major Tom. Definitely. Uh, shit, yeah, all the inmates are going to start starving now. It's a little bit annoying. We can cook up some more gristle berry. It's not the end of the world, but... Like, they've got food in here, but... Because I've not got any pinch pepper nuts, it's kind of a waste. But we'll, uh, we'll cook some of this up. Just so we don't have to open the doors just yet. Get my chefs off the bikes. Do you little swapsy. had enough tungsten a minute ago. Where's my tungsten gone? Some bastard carrying it or has he dropped it or what? Yeah, there we go. This is ground control to Major Tom. Lovely, lovely, lovely. What is that? Big old, big old pile of copper. Big old pile of refined copper. I think that's one of the things we brought back from space, isn't it? I don't think we'd have brought that much copper up here. I think we've kicked out of our spaceship. Prison gives me a funny idea, but multiple small self-contained colonies on the same map. We've done it before, Ezekiel. We've done it before, mate. Do the hydrogen make less heat? The hydrogen rockets? No, they make way more heat. Way more heat. But that's a good thing. That's not a bad thing. Why are you putting metal tiles under the rockets? Because I want to gather some of the heat off the jets when it fires. That's what I'm thinking. So the, the jets from the rocket shoot out loads when they first first set off. Um, and I want to collect all that heat and I want to send it into my steam turbine. Why not? Uh, did you consider naming the inmate dupes after the characters of Porridge for a second? Oh, that would have been good. I do like Porridge. I always enjoyed that. Bit of uh, Ronnie Barker, isn't it? I always forget the name of the young lad that... Um, I think he died, didn't he? The other guy in Porridge. I forget his name. Oh, what the fuck is the actor's name? I can't remember. I used to love Porridge when I was a kid. It was always on um, UK Gold. For any of you non-English folk, Porridge was a series by one of the two Ronnies. Ronnie Barker, the big one. Um, in which they were playing inmates. It was all about like how they get to screw over the guards and how they how they win out at the end of the day. What are you doing? Are you stuck? Uh, oh, I see what's happened here. We have some refined carbon blocking the door. It's a very good show. Mm -mm -mm. Uh, who was he in it? Uh, Ronnie Barker was Fletch. Oh, sorry, you're asking about the other guy. Was it Lenny? Lenny? What's the, what's the name of the young lad? Oh, I forget his name. Also, Porridge is still legendary to watch. Yeah, it's a great show. Can you use the thermium pump to pump steam from the steam turbine? Uh, the problem is the steam turbine pumps a lot of steam. You can do, but you'd need about 10 pumps or probably more than that. Richard Beckinsale, that's the one. Lenny Godber. Yeah. Yeah, I think he died. I think it was... I, I don't know how he died, but I remember it was one of those tragic sort of before his time kind of deals. Which sucks. It's a really good show. For anyone that's not seen it, check out Porridge. It's very good. It's a good one. Alright. Alright, guys, just so you know, there's 14 minutes left on the giveaway. There's only a couple of people that have entered at the minute. It's for White Noise 2, a bit of a spookums game. So it's a sub only giveaway. So enter now. Make sure you enter. Do exclamation point giveaway. Mm -hmm. 
Right, yeah, so a lot of this stuff we're just going to leave for now. Um, I did want to do a pre-cooling setup here, but honestly, this seems to be keeping up fine with, like, hot gas coming in. Considering this hydrogen is 50-odd degrees, the polluted oxygen that's coming in here, there's not very much at the minute, but that's 50-odd degrees. I think this will be fine. And if anything, it'll stop my hydrogen from cooling a bit too much as well. So occasionally we do get these bits of solid hydrogen. Um, although, in fairness, when the level rises in here, I don't think it'll happen so frequently. Because this single bit of pipe here gets the coldest. That's why there's solid hydrogens here. This piece of pipe is straight from the uh, straight from the aqua tuna. So my coolant's hitting this room at minus 260 odd. But it's fine. It's fine. Pink. All right, we're down to three tons of wolframite. So we're not doing the best on wolframite. I've not figured out how we're going to do the rocket on this side yet. What the fuck was that? The f oh, it was a, some, a tube carrying a bottle of petrol. That looked weird. The bottle was really red at the top then. That looked weird. Mm -mm -mm. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Uh, somebody get rid of this, please. Come on. Can't reach all this stuff. So I built, I built tiles over some of this stuff that I wanted to deconstruct. Fine, we'll get to that later. Um, so yeah, I want to rip this out now. I don't really want to destroy this reservoir, but kind of, kind of have to unless I'm going to move it somewhere else. Need to remove this pipe as well. We don't need this anymore. So let's just tidy up some of this gubbins that's up here, and we can do this on a high priority just to get it done. Um, here's my hydrogen in pipe. There's my hydrogen out pipe. That's fine. I'm going to delete this and see if it makes any blind bit of difference to our um, star map. I don't think it should. So we can still press Z to access the star map. So uh, Be warned, entering the giveaway is essentially shaving. Yeah, that's what it is. It's a daily shave. Ooh. I'm starting to get hungry, boy. I need to get some food soon. Yeah, I don't really want to just piss this oxygen into space, but I don't really need it at the minute. Uh, let's see. You're going to be my oxygen one. Let's just connect this up. Um, I'll just jank it through here for now. I'll, I'll redo all this piping and stuff later, but for now we can at least get rid of the oxygen. Let's make all this a higher priority so it gets done. Yeah, we can mop out this uh, airlock now as well, can't we? We don't need this anymore. Boop. Don't need any of this stuff. I love it. I love it. Power through the night. So yeah, as soon as we get this water flowing, this will this will water in these pipes that's meant to be heating up our pincher farm can actually uh, get flowing again. And we've got excess water, so it seems seems smart to. Peasants don't qualify. No, come on, guys. Listen, there's some people in the chat that are paying, like, you know, five quid a month. So they need to get the odd perk here and there. And I do do... I've done two giveaways today that were open to everyone. Come on. Every now and again, there's subs need to get something. It's only fair. If you were a sub, you'd feel left out if I didn't give you any perks. So come on. There has to be some perks. They're only little perks every now and again, when I can. Alright, so let's just get this oxygen pipe done for now. 
Um, and then, yeah, we'll just bridge straight into there. I think this will be clean. I don't think there'll be anything else in there. I think we cleaned all this out beforehand. <laughs> Smelly peasants are revolting. Call the guards. <laughs> I heard they eat shoes. Pseudo, what the hell? <laughs> That's a weird gambit to come in on. I hear they eat shoes. Uh, right, let's get all this ripped out. Don't need any of this gubbins anymore, do we? Um, oh, wait. I don't want you ripped out just yet. And let's get rid of all the automation that's behind here as well. So I don't remember what we built this out of, but maybe maybe there's some good stuff that I want. Built out of gold. We've got fucking shitloads of gold. We don't need this conveyor line up here either. Probably need to bridge that back into the uh, into the base. What a waste of a conveyor line this was. <laughs> oh. We can use it. I can get my dupes to empty empty stuff out. Our volcano has now cooled down a little bit, so the gold started to solidify, which is good. So it's going to be dormant for a while, this. Dormant for another 30 cycles, so. Our petrol didn't boil, so everything's fine. Alright. Then, yeah, we'll just bridge this into here. Mm -mm. How did Liquid O2 and Liquid, uh, Liquid H2 work out? Oh yeah, it seems fine, mate. It's ticking over okay. It's ticking over okay. We've got we've got some Liquid Hydrogen, we've got some Liquid Oxygen. We've launched a couple of rockets now. We have taken a little bit of damage here and there. So it could be better. Um, but realistically, I'd like to make these pipes out of insulate later and then we'd have no problems at all, ever. But uh, yeah, we'll see. It's fucking annoying the meteors damaging my, my tiles. I might make these thicker. I might make these into bunker tiles and get some wolframite back. When we've got a bit more steel, I think that's what I'll do. Because wolframite is scarcer than steel for me now, so. We'll get this reservoir emptied at least, and then we'll crack open this. And it's going to be a vacuum out here, pretty much. Apart from a few bits of carbon dioxide floating around. <gasps> Beamer on! You little star! Oh my goodness! Um, guys, Beamer on has just gifted subs to Lethality, Aerolith, Gukluma, Azenris, and Matt Dirty. You little hero. Thank you, Beamer on. That is very, very kind, mate. Thank you. Um, so yeah, for those of you that have just got subs, enter the giveaway! <laughs> Jeepers. Uh, thank you, Beamer. I'm very, very kind, mate. Holy balls. We're nearly at that sub target, guys. Holy shit, we're three subs off the sub goal. Um, yeah, you don't choose. I know, mate, it's random. But thank you, buddy. That is that is incredible. So to so those of you that just got gifted a sub, thank Beamer. What a hero. So Mex has just given you all some fluff, so you should be able to enter the giveaway. It's 100 fluff a ticket. So if you type exclamation point beard, it'll tell you what currency you've got, and then you can uh, get yourself entered into the competition. It's going to end in five minutes. It'll have to be quick. Five minutes it ends. In fact, have some more fluff, guys. I can go for it. Excellent work as well, Max. Thank you, buddy. So all you new guys should be able to enter at least once. Those of you that started watching tonight, for example. Like Aerolith, you've got enough for a ticket now. So get entered, buddy. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Ah, oh, I love it, guys. I do love it. I love it when there's some love in chat. I love the love. It's awesome. Absolutely awesome. Okay, so we're getting rid of our oxygen now. This can go into here. This is going to be hot as balls oxygen. Uh, but it should still get pretty much instantly liquefied, all being well. So it just means our aqua tune is going to have to pull its finger out in a minute. But this is good. And we can see on our sensor how quickly we're, we're liquefying it. So, job's a good one. So, you're now empty, which is great. Oh, oh shit, look at all this oxalate we've got in here. So what I'll do now, we'll get this oxalate. I was meant to sweep this up ages ago, because we've got oxalate all over the place, and I did ask for it to go into this compactor, but I left it on sweep only. So let's get everybody collecting oxalate, and we'll leave that over here. 
And we'll just let that blurp away and do its thing. Because it's no point, it's just wasting it into space. There's like quite a bit of oxalate here. Nearly two tons of oxygen, plus this in here. So we'll get all that collected. Um, and then we can rip this thing out as well. I'm assuming all that oxygen's made its way down the pipe. Yeah. And then we can... What we're probably going to do, we'll make a bigger oxygen setup here. It doesn't need to be cooled, because we'll cool it probably down here somewhere. Um, and it'll be a bigger boy oxygen room. Maybe just two two electrolyzers or three electrolyzers, maybe, and then a shitload of pumps. Um, and I'll, I might leave this two-tile high space here in case we do need access. I don't know how big this rocket's going to be. But I suppose if it does get any bigger, it's going to be access needed up here, isn't it? So... Yeah. Didn't think about the access on this side. It'll be fine. We'll figure that out later. So, let's now crack open all this stuff. Um, yeah, let's just get all of this deleted. Don't need any of this, Gubbins. Um, get these pipes out of here. All these little normal pipes can go. A magnanimous dispensation! Jesus! Ezekiel! 3,000 bits! Oh! Thank you very much, man. That is very, very kind. Holy shit. A magnanimous dispensation! Incredible, mate. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. What a fluffy hero indeed. My goodness. Thanks, buddy. I think that's the most bits I've ever had in one go. That is incredible. I think that's literally the most bits I've ever received in one hit. I'm blown away. That is really cool. Thank you. Uh, uh, uh. So bitty. Very bitty. Three big bitties straight into the mouth. Big kappa bitties. Look at them. Anyway, um, right, how much power my soul is generating? Well, you can see off your reports, um, so if I look at yesterday's reports, <coughs> solar power generated 2,191 kilojoules. My manual gens generated 998 uh, kilojoules, which is incredible, really. Six manual gens are <laughs> doing their work. Um, so, yeah, my soul is doing all right, but in fairness, my solar gens aren't finished yet as well. So that'll probably be nearly doubled. So they'll probably be somewhere like 3,200 or something um, eventually, which isn't bad. And also it is sort of dependent on the asteroids. Some cycles they'll probably generate a little bit more. Um, so this one was 2,800 uh, in this cycle. Uh, previous cycle was 2,195. So it's going to fluctuate a little bit depending on when the asteroid, you know, the meteor showers are. So... But yeah, I mean, the idea is, I mean, there obviously we've had a spike in natural gas power. But in the last cycle, sorry, the one after this one, we didn't need natural gas power all that much. We used 1,600 instead of 2,000 odd. So I like the idea of just easing off some of the, the burden of natural gas and coal. I mean, we are getting lots of natural gas, but still, I don't want to just piss it away. I like the idea of saving some of it up. So yeah, I think solar plus the little the little prison prison power farm is working pretty well. Uh, oh shit, I can't look at my star map anymore. I did think that might be a thing. Um, I just need to slap a telescope down somewhere. Oh, we'll just build one here, just for now, so I can use my star map still. Uh, stations, is it? Which is a telescope. I'll just build it out of gold. Plonk him here. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, guys, the giveaway is finished. Let's just have a look at the old giveaway. Uh, the winner is. Sordid Assistant. Thank you very much for entering. Guys, you're all heroes. Um, let me just get you your key, buddy. Uh, Sordid Assistant. Did you like my French pronunciation, mate? I did try. I did try a little bit. I suppose it'd be sordid. Um, can you say something in chat, buddy, if you don't mind? It just makes it a bit easier for me. Boop. 
Mm -mm -mm. I can't get my tepid eyes to overheat like your YouTube video for the super easy steam jelly. Did they fix something? Uh, no, it's you need to use a pulse clock, silent one. You need a pulse clock, and that will get it to work. Uh, Sorted, where are you, son of a gun? Mm -mm. I'm to scroll up. He said something just before. Where is he? Ah, there you go. Sorted. There you go, buddy. I've sent you your key. Congratulations, mate. Uh, there you go, bud. Enjoy. Uh, uh, I need to learn all these things. Learn me, bearded one. What do you mean, Beamron? Learns me! <laughs> what do you mean? Uh, beautiful. Can I now use my star map again? Yeah, I can. Okay, my rocket's on its way back. Yeah, I think we're going to go for this boy next, aren't we? Um, so we're probably going to have to farm up a little bit of steel. But honestly, guys, I think what I'm going to say is it's midnight. I've had a lovely stream, but I'm very, very hungry. I've not had any tea yet. I've not spoken to the woman properly. I didn't speak to her yesterday either. Um, oh, my goodness. My goodness. I'm about to wrap up the stream, and you're all dropping sub bombs. Oh. <gasps> Guys, I was done for the night. Ezekiel! What the hell? Ezekiel gifting subs. Jesus. My goodness. Well, we've hit the sub target, guys. I can't believe it. Or we won off. Or we won off the sub target. That isn't crazy. That is crazy. Um, it's tier 1, sub 2. Anonymous. Anonymous, you are now subbed. And Veldino, you are now subbed. My goodness. Ezekiel, that is very, very kind. Thank you. Thank you very much. Um, oh my goodness, what is going on? Mentos man, thank you very much for the sub, buddy. We've hit the target, guys. 125. Hold on a minute. This is incredible. You little legends. Honestly, all of you. Um, yeah, I think we're going to be done with Oni for tonight. Because honestly, I'm hungry. I'm starting to lose attention. So what I'm going to do... I'm, I'm blown away by this. I don't really want to wrap the stream up when you're all you're all being so lovely and chat and subbing and gifting and oh my goodness. Thank you. Genuinely. Thank you. Really is appreciated. Um let me just do my little uh, my little thank yous because we've got lots of follows and lots of new people tonight. Um so yeah. As ever, special thanks to my lovely mods. Uh, you're incredibly, incredibly helpful. You make the dream work. I love you all, even Mex. Thank you, guys. Um, for the bits tonight, uh, Ezekiel, amazing. Thank you. Oh, my goodness. Beamron, what the hell? Uh, for the follows, uh, Aerolith, uh, Schizophrenia, Schizophrenia, uh, Palza, Arclight, um, Assault Troop, and Servi. Thank you very much for the follows. Welcome. For the subs and resubs, uh, Delmain, Joe, and I think these are the gifted subs now, Lethality, Aerolith, Gekluma, Azenris, Matt Dirty, Veldin, Anonymous, uh, Mentos Man, what the heck just happened now? Beamron's gifting more subs. A special thanks to Beamron and Ezekiel, by the way, guys. Seriously. Wow. Oh, Mentos Man as well for the sub. Thank you. Uh, Beamron's given more subs. Calamazo. Thank you. Thank you. And Kurum Karameruk. Thank you very much. Jesus, guys. Uh, I'm, I'm off tomorrow. I'm going to have a break tomorrow. I'll probably do a little bit of tidying up in the base, uh, but we'll be back on Sunday. Now, just a reminder for all you new viewers and for those of you old ones that are forgetful like me, um, it is a 4 p.m. start on Sunday, right? Now, we are super, super close to hitting this average to, to apply for partner. So if as many of you can be here on Sunday as possible at 4 p.m. GMT, that would be really appreciated. Oh, no, my lurk has been messed up. <laughs> Sorry, Karim, I shouldn't have called you out, mate. Um, incredible, guys. Thank you very much for the, for the bits and the, the subs and stuff. It is incredible. Um, so yeah, 4pm on Sunday We'll probably be playing some more Oni um, I'll do a bit of a tidy up between streams As I say, so that we'll get a bit of the Sweeping and stuff gone so we won't be as laggy um, But yeah, incredible Again, much, much love guys, I hope you have a nice weekend And I will see you on Sunday Brighter, Bright eyed, bushy tailed um, And we'll hopefully do some big old rockets to space So yeah, much love guys, take it easy Good night, bye see bye